Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, the defendant here would have you believe that he is innocent by reason of insanity. State your name. My name is Tony Montana. <laughs> I'm a political prisoner from Cuba, okay? Where do you live? I live in California, man. You know, that's where I make all the Jell-O brand pudding commercials. <laughs> With my wife and my five children. Sometimes I live in New York. It's all the same thing. <laughs> And the same as but what do you do for a living? My fellow Americans, I was supposed to be running this country, but my wife Hillary beat me to the point. Now, would you say that some people... <laughs> that some people might accuse you of having an attitude problem? Who, oh, me? Andrew Dice Clay, the most controversial, unbelievable comic I've ever walked the planet? Sure they do, but let me tell you something. I got an attitude. You got an attitude. The judge has an attitude. There's no problem. you on the night of the murder. I was over at Jefferson's house, dear. <laughs> Where the hell do you think I was, dear me? <laughs> hey, let's go get me a beer there. Make yourself useful. So you were at Jefferson's house. Well, could you describe Mr. Jefferson's house? It was a luxurious 12-room mansion in the Hamptons. <laughs> Owned by Hollywood's greatest superstars. It had a 14-carat gold toilet bowl, a jacuzzi, and a pool in the backyard, all for a cool $10 million. <laughs> Isn't it true that you joined the police academy with the express purpose of learning how to fire a gun so you could use that gun on the murder victim? <laughs> <laughs> On the night in question, on the night in question, were you drinking? <laughs> oh, of course I was drinking. <laughs> you know, they say that eight glasses of water a day is very good for your body. <laughs> With a little bit of whiskey. <laughs> Just how long, on the night in question, did it take you to go from your house to the apartment of the murder victim? Well, uh, gee, uh, it uh, took pretty long, Mr. Bunny Rabbit. Uh... How do you hold so much contempt in your heart for someone who you claim to have been in love with? I'm Geraldo Rivera. <laughs> And the secret answer to that and many other questions is locked inside Al Capone's vault. Join me on the next Geraldo. All right, look. I want to cut to the chase with you. I'm tired of playing games. I'm going to ask you some questions. I want answers. I want the truth. You can't handle the truth. <laughs> Let 
me tell you something, mister. I eat breakfast every single morning of my life, 300 yards away from 4,000 Cubans that are ready to shoot me at the drop of a dime. Do you think that you can come in here with your lawyer lingo and just intimidate me? Did you kill your lover? You're damn right I did! <laughs> How did you do it? Wendy, give me the bat, Wendy. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just gonna bash your brains in, Wendy. I'm not gonna hurt you, Wendy. I'm gonna Ladies. bash you right in, Wendy. Ladies Come and gentlemen on. of the jury, I rest my case. He is guilty, guilty, guilty as charged. May God have mercy to you. with Fit-In Institute and The Far Side.